Hello everyone, it's me ASMR welcoming you to my new Photoshop tutorials and today I'll show you skin retouching process. First I want to give thanks here the Veronica Mammoth. This photo is her snap and uh, I'm just uh, editing this one. This is not my one. I'm just using this one for the education and purpose. So thanks to Veronica Mammoth. So let's start the tutorial. If you're new in my channel, please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notifications. So this one is the RC2. That means the camera raw. That means raw file. Uh, RC that is for the Sony users uh, file format and you are getting this one. Okay. Here uh, I'll open it up at first going to here open as object. So it will help me out to open this one again into the camera raw filter. Press Ctrl or Command J and it will make copy another copy of this layer. Okay. Right press and restylize the layer. So in this phase, here is some spots and uh, other stuffs. So going to the spot healing brush tool. Before that, reset this one. Press the D, it will reset and then spot healing brush tool make it normal brush size 80 pixel that's fine and container is selected and select once it will take the pixel from B side another side and fill it up and remove that things so you can get the prominent spot you should remove at first in these lips here is some spots just click once okay that's good here are some spots you should remove that things though this one is blur but uh, the spot is uh, just getting out from the blurry options okay from here as well okay that's fine we'll do frequency separation to edit this photo press ctrl j and j so another one is blur giving the name and the this layer will be sharp okay that's fine blur selecting this one that means this layer and going to the filter and then blur and gaussian blur so this gaussian blur will help you out to make this one blurry portion so making this one blur little bit yeah that's fine and here the sharp making it hard light and then going to the filter again and other and high pass so it will help you out to get the textures so you are getting the textures from here and hit okay that's fine select these two layer making this one group from here and giving the name smooth making it mask and making it reverse mask so now we'll do this one by the help of the brush tool here the brush going to the brush tool select the brush first one soft brush and make this one normal and making the size a little bit smaller okay you can control the size by using third bracket opening and closing you can uh, press the third bracket closing it will be bigger and third bracket opening it will smaller so if you brush this one it will be more smooth before that you have to give give the opacity down and the value of the flow down now we can just make it blur so selecting these things making this one into like that that means you can make it smart object convert to smart object so after that going to the filter and then neural filter from the neural filter you can uh, use the photo as a skin smoothing it will help you out to making it smooth and then less blur so before and after you are getting the hues change over here and hit the ok button so before and after you're getting huge change now we'll go to the filter again and going to the camera raw filter from camera filter we'll do color correction from all the panels here you can select or pick color from here actually the eye color you can choose 
or you can pick color from these flower or leaves so yeah in a from this portion you can choose color okay that's fine from here here is the tint and temperature that's good and here going to the color mixture at first and the saturation of the blue i'll make it up and luminance of the blue i'll make it up just because of the eyes are blues and here the aqua as well the saturation the aqua as well so here that's fine in the face we're getting the luminance of the red orange and yellow so orange i'll make it a little bit down and saturation i'll make it down a little bit and the red saturation i'll make it up and luminance i'll make it down the lips will be prominent yeah that's fine and in this portion i'll go to the detail noise reduction a little bit and color noise reduction a little bit and going to the basic options adding some texture yeah that's good and then going to the detail again and adding some sharpness that's fine going to the calibration you can change the calibration or adjust the calibration a little bit here's the red primary you can if you change this one like that it will act like this here is three primary colors green uh, here is a red primary and uh, the blue primary okay and hit the ok button follow my settings it will help you out to make this one more um, like uh, professional going to the filter again going to the nick collection and color effects pro 4 so here i will apply another filter bunch of filters actually so it will loading it up and hit ok after loading that i am using here the cross processing and lots of method over here so from here uh, lots of sub method you can get so i'm using l02 just because of this is uh, perfect for me hit okay so it will take a little bit time to load it up and uh, it will provide you the final output so from here we'll go to the here the levels options i think this is too much white and i'll make it a little bit like this yeah that's fine so another way to uh, reduce the all lights of the sides uh, you can add the gradient so going to the gradient and making it radial and making it reverse it will make a zero percent and i'll make increase that so and hit okay or you can adjust the light after adding the gradient you're getting the prominent of the eyes focus and it will help you out to uh, use the focus point in a uh, uh, eyes so here opacity you can make a little bit down so now this one is blended options so let's see the before one normal uh, non-edited image and after one you are getting the professional edited image so hope that you learn a lot from this video if you did please thumbs up and share with your friend and if you have any kind of question query or request please do comment on my video comment section until the next video i'm asm i'm signing out stay safe stay at home keep me in your prayers bye bye